so let's start the uh, this lesson in this lesson I'll show you how to implement room database with dagger hilt as you know the uh, hilt is a latest uh, dependency injection library from Google after dagger 2 uh, let's see what we will implement this is our screen in this you can see the data from uh, it uh, this this data comes from the API initially when the when the app is installed for the first time it takes the data from the server and then it saves the data to the local database and for the next time when the app launch launches uh, it we will check if there is any data from uh, sub, uh, from uh, from database then it will show the database uh, it will show the data from database here if there is no database uh, there is no data from database then it will call the api this is the check uh, which i have uh, implemented here to know uh, uh, so that we don't call the api again and again we will uh, load the data locally from database and one uh, thing i have uh, implemented in this uh, project is that you can see the swipe to delete delete gesture is also implemented to lead to delete the data locally uh, if i just uh, swipe left it deletes the data like this this is the last ent entry if there is no entry then it will call the api again this is the method as you can see this is the method and here is the observer this is the observer this method it it automatically call, uh, gets called whenever there is change in uh, list in database so for the for the final uh, deletion when the data is deleted every uh, entry uh, you know the uh, this data comes from api again if there is no entry in the database so this is what we uh, we can implement using this uh, tutorial and you can get this project from github i will uh, i will add the github link also you can download it and uh, run it and you know copy and paste the required uh, code so this project contains uh, room data room database mvvm co uh, coroutines and dagger hilt and data binding retrofit uh, let me give you the uh, introduction uh, regarding the uh, the code structure here this is the adapter class and these are the constants um, in which we have implemented which we have implemented the base URL and this is the uh, uh, DAO class this is the database room database this is the repository this is the uh, view model class which we will use this in this uh, activity or treatment here we have declared it and with the help of this we have in initialized the uh, observer and the method also to delete and add here we are inserting the entries database here uh, we are getting the uh, the updates in the uh, whenever there is uh, there is any new entry or uh, entry being deleted from the database and this this is the dependency injection of app module class we have declared the uh, retrofit object and basic on, uh, app authentication here and our room database initialized here and this is the base class application class in which we have initialized the hilt and these are the model uh, package and network for api uh, retrofit uh, API uh, interface and this is the API INPL API service 
repository and these are the states so basically DAO uh, the DAO which is the room database part is the in uh, this is the package to implement the uh, room database and this is the dependency injection this is the retrofit you uh, when you download the code or view the code on the github you can see this and uh, run the code also you can copy and paste the required code so this uh, this is what we will uh, implement and one more thing if you just turn off the internet if you just disconnect the internet and run the app it will fetch the data from the local database if there is no database then you will see nothing but if you just connect the internet and launch the app again it will call the api so this tutorial was to show you the uh, implementation of uh, room database with dagger hilt using coroutines mvvm data binding view binding and retrofit so i hope uh, you learned a lot from this tutorial and you will be able to implement it easily if you find any issue or you don't understand anything you can let me know in the comment section i will try my best to help you out and please subscribe my channel so that you can get the recent uh, updates and press the bell icon also